Thank you, Bradley. I'm Bob Beard. Thank you for joining us. The mystery surrounding a seven-foot boa constrictor spotted in the Seminole Square shopping center has been solved. After missing for two months, the snake called a red-tailed boa is now on its way to a new home. Charlottesville tonight's Rachel Ryan has more on the story you first saw on CBS 19 News. On the run for two months, this boa constrictor showed up in the parking lot of the Boathouse restaurant right by this former employee's car. Uh, as wide as round as a uh, Foster's beer can, and it's about seven feet long. Probably weighs about 40, 50 pounds. The snake is something of a legend around Seminole Square. What I heard is that the pet store here in the shopping center closed down, released their animals, um, and then somebody saw the boa constrictor. Um, then one of our dishwashers here at Boathouse saw the boa constrictor one night, and he decided to stab it, um, which is why it's got its injuries now. Those stab wounds still visible. The snake believed to be dead after several searches turned up empty. People would show up here and like, you guys come to join us to dine? And they're like, no, we came to look for the snake. Garver wasn't looking for the snake. He was just there to pick up his paycheck. I saw that it was injured, and I, I didn't want to leave it to just die or call animal control, so I, um, Got on the phone and tried to call everybody I could to find out some animal rescue, and I found the Central Virginia Reptile Rescue, so I figured we'd get it, get it a good home instead of just leaving it out here to die. Garver's home is not an option. My girlfriend will not let me keep it. I would love to keep this animal. It's a beautiful, beautiful snake, but uh, I'm not allowed to keep it, so. The Central Virginia Reptile Rescue crew answered the call, picking up the snake and the cardboard box it's being held in until they find it a more permanent home. Rachel Ryan, Charlottesville Tonight. All right, thank you, Rachel. The snake is still suffering from stab wounds, will probably need surgery. The Reptile Rescue Center is based out of Dillwyn and say the snake will be placed with a pet store or a school once it has healed.